So yeah, that's my breakfast with my mini finished apple for today. Then I'm going to bake and then get all the energy in the world to actually push. But don't say I didn't plug you in this cafe. It's the best coffee. It's the baby. Okay. Cool. guys please don't mind my hand because like i sliced my finger this morning why would i slice my finger on a sunday morning bro like ugh, shit but anyways basically while we're still on the staycation right please do check out my staycation videos guys like honestly i really put in the time <laughs> i put in the time and the effort to just really make that shit bang so please do check out my staycation stuff so what happened during the staycation after we went for the swim right after we went to swim we all took a shower after and I was the last one to take a shower, right? That Saturday. Next thing, guys, my sister's my jazz, guys. Like, big ass jackets. I'm so puzzled because I'm just like, I got out of the shower, I'm feeling so hot, and it's so hot. It, like, it was really hot, hot that day. And like, it was hot, hot, like in Joburg, it was really hot. So like, now I'm kind of puzzled why you guys wearing jackets. Anyways, let me insert clip here of those hands wearing jackets. So, you know, that same week when we got home, which is that same week where I was baking. Yeah. During the week, right, around like Boma Thursday, my sister starts getting sick. So she says um, her tonsils are starting because she had pork. My sister shouldn't eat pork because, yeah, tonsils problems. But like, obviously, it's like a genetic thing because like they used to bother me as well when I was young. So I had to get that operation ASAP and get that shit out of me. So, which I did when I was young. So, cool. Anyways, um, that's why I'm a tea girl now. <laughs> she went to the doctor she gives us an update in the group so i have a group with my sisters and then zama as well says yo guys i'm actually suffering from a headache i've been suffering from this headache like since we're on the staycation and it's like a week down and i still have this headache which is really bad i'm like hello what's happening okay she goes to the doctor when she goes to the doctor they tell her that she has this bug i don't know what bug that she has this bug and whatever she oh, tonsils it's a genetic thing whatever 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 all that shandies you know so like i'm just like what the hell so sunday night my sister starts showing these flu-like symptoms my mom's like she suspects it's covid uh. that same week when i started baking two days later that's when i started getting sick how oh. thursday i wake up i 
could feel like my throat is acting funky you know but i'm just like okay probably like i'm starting to get hay fever because hay fever really hits me a lot especially when the year begins i told myself okay this is the last day i'm exercising i went to go steam later that night when i was done steaming guys my temperature dropped completely i was freezing and it is hot in Joburg, believe you me my i started freezing my sister's like you're getting sick and i said <laughs> no i anyways um i woke up that friday i thought i was gonna wake up feeling better that friday i woke up that friday i had a lump in my throat like i could not eat i could not speak i could not do anything so i started isolating um it sucked i know um yeah started isolating oh time went by time went by guys my symptoms started getting worse later that weekend i drank benelin benelin was not doing nothing for me guys nothing my temperature i had a fever later that night i couldn't even sleep i could not sleep because i was sweating i had this fever everything just said like the parts a new week monday monday i was really getting sick guys time really went by as time was really going by during that week i okay so basically that weekend i got um pills from the doctor right i'm talking your antibiotics probiotics and um meds that did obviously cater for flu i drank all of them guys like i drank all of them and i wasn't getting any better i was losing some symptoms like the fever yeah the fever was actually going away the headaches also were going away and i was gaining other symptoms while i was losing this i was gaining other symptoms i start i wasn't able to hear guys i started losing my hearing i started having chest pains i quit my nose is still congested my sinuses said flash your pants i was like yeah i saw the gates of heaven open so and i said what not now i still need to charm my youth and that anyways um so yeah time went by um i wasn't really getting any better so this was week two entering into week two of being sick in feb so yeah time went by i really wasn't getting any better my symptoms were really worse guys like i could not even hear my hearing wasn't even getting better i don't know what was going on my eyes were getting very dry my throat was very dry there was one night i couldn't sleep i was coughing throughout because i couldn't inhale and exhale like i could not i couldn't every single time i tried through my mouth my throat was just doing that scratching thing and i used to cough the whole night i was going through a lot i was going through a lot i was going through a lot and i was going through it so yeah that was what was happening at first like i thought i had covid initially like when it started i thought yo coviding bambi le footy because um closer to the end of december i was actually sick i had to come back home to isolate going to jan i was in isolation but and now it's feb isolation again i said nah bro nah and guys like if you obviously have covid that shit would have worked you know i wasn't talking about drinking stone with like the spring kind of thing like i was fully on medication do you understand what i'm saying fully thoroughly and i was not getting better so i knew that nah man something really isn't right so like a part of me was like let me try allergex first before i go to the doctor if allergex doesn't work then i'm gonna go to the doctor i got allergex and your girl became better when i tell you to listen to your intuition when it tells you to get that thing better get it that is when this has been filmed during that valentine's day week which was one week okay so anyways let's progress with the vlog this I will Um, so yeah, we're going into the mall and then I'll give you guys Hi, some bananas, Milan. So yeah, we're going in right now and then speak to you guys probably prop properly. So yeah, um, what do I need? I need magnesium. I need 
an eyelash curler. What is what? Why did you hurt yourself? I don't know. I need an eyelash curler. I need what else do I need? I think I need those two things. But if I do need additional stuff, I, I'll show you when I get back. So. <laughs> Yeah, I know. I look, my skin looks a bit damp, but guys, I'm honestly feeling so hot. I need to sanitize my hands a bit because you have had the longest day. So, um, got samosas. I also got a Coke to drink. Initially, I wanted to buy iced coffee from McDonald's. I kept asking my, oh, guys, like I'm really drenched, bro. Like it's hot. Yo. Then you still have to put this mask on, yes. Like, yeah, I said to my daughter, and I was like, what's the point of getting coffee? Drinking coffee so late. Anyways, we're back home, guys. Yo, I was sweating. I was drenched. But anyways, now I'm fine. My sister got two books. While we were waiting for her. Saving Tengele. Makeup for winter. Love this. Love a baby. I definitely recommend having a baby. Um... I also got this eyelash curler because my eyelash at sweetheart's my yo my eyelashes are long long so yeah I got this one and not the one that has the comb stuff. Eggs, so, yeah, we got some speckled eggs. Speckled. 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 <laughs> speckled, 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 whatever. Yeah, those we got speckled eggs. I also got magnesium from this camp because um, I've been struggling to sleep since this week has started because yeah um, I have been shown a lot of shit <laughs> guys um actually purchased some lip stick lip whatever I wanted a brown color and I got this one and I was quite hesitant about getting this one this is how it looks and this is darker than I anticipated Shit. <laughs> 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 Now. Hi guys, um, I know that I haven't checked in with y'all in a very, very, very long time, but today is Sunday and me and my sister are going to Bram. In Juta, yeah, we're going to that 99 Juta place in Bram. I know that they have a page on Instagram where like they post the events and stuff, which is what my sister follows. But yeah, she's like, let's go to this event, bro. I was watching Inventing Anna the whole day and I'm blown away. When... <laughs> So I left my camera 
Um, guys, I sang. Oh my god. To do karaoke. Guys, I am being bullied. Ting tati mask. Um, she's like, I'm not gonna go until you sing, boo. And I said, what? Now I'm being forced, guys. Now we're in the car charging her phone so that I can catch it via landscape. Now I have to go sing Amanda Mazana remix, being pro kids songs because I also I always sing those songs for you guys. But the thing is, I don't want to sing pro kid because I feel like people inside there don't even listen to pro kid and. <laughs> And me, local is better. So, yeah, I don't know. The girl said, I'm going to the club. I told you guys, you see, when I listen to Sama Yomit, I told you guys, I said, What? Club, the club is calling what? Guys, um, now I'm being forced to actually sing Amanto Mazana remix. Yo, uh, uh, so yeah, this karaoke Sunday night at Kitchener's, if you guys want to go, I'm putting you guys on the spot. Even though before that we were at 99 Juta, and then... They have a drama. I must say, it's falling, a drama. Guys, some guy came to me and my sister, and he said, Babies, you're like effing hot. I said, if I was a guy, I'd get it. <laughs> Honestly, I'm gonna go back into Kitchener's and then tell her what we must because the Muni girl doesn't want to leave until I sing. And the thing is, guys, I'm so sober to sing. I need to be in the plug, bro. Like, I need to be in the plug, plug to sing. Now I'm so bad. And I'm just like, because, like, oh, yeah, shit, me, me, I have anxiety. You know, I'm about to anxiety. You know, anxiety. But yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, <laughs>